morning, I guess, I guess it's afternoon. <laughs> God bless you. A blessed feast of Our Lady's visitation. This is my patronal feast day. My name is Mary Elizabeth. So I take the Feast of the Visitation of Our Lady to Elizabeth as my feast day. And I am a bit later than I planned this morning, but I just published my seventh book. And it was on Our Lady and I wanted to get it out this morning so that the Kindle will be available in a few hours. And the print book should be available by tonight or tomorrow morning at the latest. I came home last night from Chicago. I got home about nine and I ran a couple hours on the, a couple miles, not a couple hours, on the treadmill and then went to proofreading the final copy and doing edits. So I was up just have had a busy 24 hours. I work till about 1.30 in the morning and then I fell asleep and woke up at 3.45 and went through some more edits back and forth with my publisher and then got up this morning and had to finish it. But I am so excited to have this book available. It's called House of Gold. And it has this image of the Maria Bambina on it. It's a consecration to the infant, immaculate, and sorrowful heart of Our Lady, especially under the titles of Star of the Sea and Mystic Rose. But in the litany of Our Lady, we call her the House of Gold. And so that's what I chose for um, the title of the book. So you can look for that on Amazon and it's a way to go deeper into the titles of Our Lady and then also um, to consecrate yourself to Our Lady, especially in her infancy because her immaculate and sorrowful heart, the perfection of her virtue was present from the very first moments of her immaculate conception. And she grew in grace, but she... Um, was full of grace from the very beginning. Right? So we go through, I have so many beautiful um, writings of the saints contained in this book. Bernard of Clairvaux, Maximilian Kolbe, St. Louis de Montfort, St. Francis de Sales, and then um, John the Paul II, the, the great um, kind of surprise that the Lord brought me was a lot of beautiful writing by Cardinal John Henry Newman and Our Lady and um, St. Ildefonsus. I don't know if you've ever heard of him. I had only known about Ildefonsus because my brother BJ took him as his confirmation saint. I think because his name was silly and they were trying to get strange named people. But uh, he has some beautiful writing on Our Lady, a book called The Crown of Mary. It's not necessarily an easy read, but it's beautiful. So I use some of his writing on Our Lady as a rose and as a star in this book. And then at the end, there's a way that kind of helps you schedule out if you wanted to do a 33-day consecration using the book and a prayer of consecration and then all sorts of supplementary prayers. And as you know, many months ago, I got the statue of the Maria Bambina. It's very hard to find a beautiful one. I ordered it from Italy. They have a, a big shrine to her in Milan. So I was able to import it. But ever since I graduated from Notre Dame, I've had a devotion to the Maria Bambina. Under that title, I, I heard about her first at the hermitage I went to. And then later on when my grandma died and my mom was going through all of her things, 
she found all this information on that devotion and some pictures and things from Milan and my mom had never known about it. And I said, that's so incredible that my grandma had a devotion, a hidden devotion to her because we didn't know that. And I separately discovered her in Texas because of the devotion in Mexico that was special. So if you want to learn all about Our Lady and that just great radiant purity and humility that she embodies, get a copy of that book. It's called House of Gold and it should be available in the next 24 hours, but it's so beautiful. So that's why I'm a little bit later today, but being the Feast of the Visitation, and it's my feast day. Like I said, my name is Mary Elizabeth, so I consider it my feast day. And so I had to come and pray with you. And we pray for the world. We pray for an increase in those virtues of humility and purity in the world. Right? And we pray for... Um, our own hearts and then in our homes and our workplaces and our parishes and cities, that we could be instruments of peace like Our Lady was. And we pray for all of our normal intentions and all of the intentions on these pages. There's so many intentions people add daily. And we pray for them all. We pray for your personal intentions. Pray for the conversion of Russia, for peace in the Ukraine, for the triumph of the Immaculate Heart in this world. We pray for a restoration of holy friendship. <clears throat> you see in the mystery of the visitation between Mary and Elizabeth, the gift of friendship. What it means to truly have a relationship based in the love of God. And Our Lady was a true friend to Elizabeth and John the Baptist within her womb and to Zechariah, her husband as well, right? And so we pray that our world may have that gift of selfless people who are pure and humble and holy and faithful, right? And we pray for all of my intentions as well. I ask in your mercy for those intentions. Today's Tuesday, so we always remember the angels, but I'm letting Our Lady's Feast Day usurp. Instead of putting the angels out, I put Mary out, right? We're almost here to the end, and then we will begin. Meditations, I think, from my Mornings with Mary book, right? We're going to pray the Joyful Mysteries because it's the feast day. It's a joyful feast day. So in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. O Jesus, in union with your most precious blood, poured out on the cross and offered in every mass, I offer you today my prayers, works, joys, sorrows, and sufferings for the praise of your holy name and all the desires of your sacred heart and reparation for sin and the conversion of sinners, for the union of all Christians, for all of the intentions of my heart and for our final union with you in heaven, amen. My queen and my mother, I give myself entirely to you and to show my devotion to you. I consecrate to you this day my eyes, my ears, my mouth, my heart, my entire self without reserve. Wherefore, good mother, as I am thy own, keep me and guard me as thy property and possession. Amen. Oh, that you would bless me indeed and enlarge my territory, that your hand would be with me and you would keep me from evil, that I may not cause pain. I believe in God, the Father, the Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and the third day he rose again from the dead. 
He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father, the Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. For Pope Francis, the cardinals, archbishops, bishops, and the priests who work for them. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. For an increase of faith. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of hope. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For an increase of love, charity, and conversion. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first joyful, oopsie, moved. The first joyful mystery is the Annunciation. And we pray in this mystery, we remember Our Lady's great fiat, her surrender to God and his plan. We ask for the grace to say fiat to God along with her. And we ask for docility of heart, for trust, and for a great yes to God with our lives. The Annunciation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Bless, blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, <clears throat> now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. It's today's feast day. In this mystery, we see how not only Mary said yes to God in the Annunciation to receive Jesus into her womb and heart, but also how she did not keep this gift for herself. In this mystery, Mary was the great tabernacle, like a monstrance, carrying baby Jesus to St. Elizabeth. And they spoke in such a way that their eyes, minds, and hearts were centered on God. Our Lady prayed the Magnificat as St. John the Baptist, a little embryo in the womb of St. Elizabeth, was baptized by Jesus' presence in Mary. She prayed, my soul proclaims, magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked in great mercy at my lowliness, and henceforth all generations shall call me blessed. For the Almighty One has done great things for me, and holy is his name. In this mystery, we pray that we too may carry Christ as our light to those around us, and that our lives may always and every way magnify the Lord. The Visitation. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Russian. Radusia Maria, Blagadati Polnaya, Gaspod Staboyo, Blagoslavian Natim Jonami, I Blagoslavian Plochereva Tvayevo Isus, Svetaya Maria, Mater Boja, Malisa nas grishni, nini vchas smirti nashi amen, Polish. Strovash Maria waski pauna pan stabo, bogoswavio nashtinian zanevastami, i bogoswavio ni ovot shivota tvayego Jesus. Shventa Maria matka boja, mudal shizanami kshishnimi, terasi vgojina i smirti nashi amen, Spanish. Dios te salve Maria, llena eres de gracia el Señor es contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito el se fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y a la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Italian. Oops. Ave Maria, piena de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Tu sei benedetta fra le donne, y benedetto el fruto del tuo seno, Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, re, Dio, prega per noi pecadores, adesso en el hora de la nostra muerte. Amén. Latin. Ave Maria, gracia plena, Dominus tecum. Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus, fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostri. Amen. Russian, Radusia Maria, Blagadati Polnaya, Gaspod Staboy, 
Blagoslavian, Tinez de Jonami, E Blagoslavian Plodreva, Tvayevo Isus. Svetaya Maria, Matir Boja, Malisa Nas Grishni, Nini Vcha Smirti Nashi Amen, Polish. Strovash Maria, Waski Pauna Pansta Bon, Bogoslavionish Tinians and Evasan, E Bogoslavioni Ova Chivota Tvayego Jesus. Shventa Maria, Matka Boja, Mudal Shizanami Kshishnimi, Terasiv Gojina, Ishmir Chinashi Amen, Spanish. Dios de Salve Maria, Yenares de Grazia, El Señor es contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito el se fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores. Ahora y la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Italia. Ave María, piena de gracia, el Señor y conté. Tu se benedetta fra la donne, y benedetto el fruto del tu Señor Jesu. Santa María, Madre de Dio, prega per noi pecadori, ed el son a la hora de la nuestra muerte. Amén. Latin. Ave María, gracia plena, Dominus Tecum. Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus, fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostri, Amen. Gloria, Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, Et in secula, seculorum, amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave. Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The third joyful mystery is the birth of baby Jesus in Bethlehem. We read, in this mystery, we see the great poverty of baby Jesus, already rejected by the world and born in a stable fit for animals. And yet the angels came to adore him in song. The poor shepherds and the wise men came to give him homage. And Mary and Joseph knelt over this tiny child, our Eucharistic bread of life, lying in a manger, with such prayerful devotion that heaven seemed to stand in awe. In this mystery, we pray for the humble poverty of spirit that the Holy Family encompassed in Bethlehem. And we ask for a deeper love, adoration, and devotion to his little Eucharistic heart. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. <coughs> now and at the hour of our death, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave. Ave Maria. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of the child Jesus in the temple. In this mystery, we begin to see the price of Our Lady's fiat. Here, she and Joseph present baby Jesus in the temple and are already told about the great sufferings he will endure. This child will be for the rise and fall of many people, a sign to be contradicted. And you, his mother, a sword will pierce, so that the hearts of many souls may be revealed. The fiat that Our Lady gave in the Annunciation is repeated in the temple. To the degree that she loves her son, and to the degree that they are united in flesh and in God, is a degree to which she will suffer. Love unites. You suffer to the degree that you love, and holy love increases as suffering increases. In this mystery, we ask for the graces that Mary and Joseph had to continue in fiat to the mysterious plan of God that includes suffering in the life of baby Jesus and in their own lives as well. And we pray that with them, we may keep Christ as the center of our lives and hearts, pondering these things in our hearts with him. The presentation in the temple. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Russian. Radusia Maria. Blagada ti polnaya gaspots de boyu. Blagaslavia na tinyej de jonani. I blagaslavia plechereva tvaevo isus. Svetaya Maria matir boja malisa nas krishni. Nini v chasmir tinashi amen. Polish. Strovash Maria waski pauna pan stabon. Bogoswavio nashtimians and avastami, i bogoswavio ni ovot shavotat fayagu Jesus. 
Shventa Maria Mat Kabosha Mudal Shazanami Kshishnimi Terasi Fogina I Shmirchi Nashi Amen Spanish. Dios te salve Maria llena de este gracia, el Señor es contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres, y bendito el se fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa Maria, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y a la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Italia. Ave Maria, piena de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Tu se benedetta fra la donne, e benedetto il frutto del tuo segno, Gesù. Santa Maria, Madre di Dio, prega per noi peccatori, adesso e nell'ora della nostra morte. Amen. Latin. Ave Maria, grazia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus, fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, Ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostri. Amen. Russia. Radius ia Maria blagada ti polnaia, gaspod staboio, blagaslavian natimia ishtajonami, i blagaslavian plod shreva tvaia vo isus. Svetaia Maria, mater boja, malisa nas grishni, nini vchas mirti nashi. Amen. Polish. Strovash Maria waski pauna pan stabo, Bogoswavionish timians and avastami, e Bogoswavioni ova shavata tvaego Jesus. Shventa Maria, mat kaboja, mural shesanami kshishne, Terasiv gojina e shmirchina shi amen, Spanish. Dios te salve Maria, yena reis de gracia, el Senor is contigo. Bendita tu eres entre todas las mujeres. Y bendito el se fruto de vientre Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, rega por nosotros pecadores, ahora y en la hora de nuestra muerte. Amén. Italia. Ave María, piena de gracia, el Señor es contigo. Tu se benedetta fra la donna y benedetto el fruto del tu Señor Jesús. Santa María, Madre de Dios, prega por nosotros pecadores, Adesso la lora della nostra muerte. Amen. Latin. Ave Maria, grazia plena, Dominus tecum. Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Santa Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccatoribus, nunc et in ora mortis nostri. Amen. Rush, oops. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritu e Sancta. Sicud erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, and help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession, the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. The fifth joyful mystery is the finding of the child Jesus in the temple. In this mystery, we see an example of humility in the priesthood priests allowing themselves to be taught by a child. We also see a great example of steadfastness in Jesus, willing to follow the Father's will, regardless of the cost, even if it causes the pain of confusion to his parents who he loved. We see Our Lady and Joseph willing to endure the loss both of their child and their God in the midst of misunderstanding and continually reaching forth for answers as to God's will for their lives. They searched, they questioned, they accepted, and they pondered. In this mystery, we pray for wisdom, knowledge, understanding, right judgment, truth, and life. We pray for those discerning God's will in their lives. We pray for those who feel like they've lost Jesus. We especially pray for priests to have the humility that they need to learn from children. 
and we pray for the grace to always father, follow the Father's call, regardless of the cost to us and to those who we love on earth. The finding in the temple. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to... Oops! Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, help especially those who are most in need of thy mercy. Come, Holy Spirit, come by the means of the powerful intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, thy well-beloved spouse. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, O most gracious advocate, thy eyes of mercy towards us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O holy Mother of God, that we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, 
by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us rewards of eternal life. Grant, we beseech thee, that by meditating on the mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known, that anyone who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, or sought thy intercession, was left unaided. Inspired by this confidence, we fly unto thee, O Virgin of Virgins, our Mother. To thee do we come, before thee we stand, sinful and sorrowful. O Mother of the Word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer us. Amen. O Saint Joseph, whose protection is so great, so strong, so prompt before the throne of God, I place in you my interests and desires. O Saint Joseph, do assist me by your powerful intercession and obtain for me from your divine Son all spiritual blessings through Jesus Christ our Lord, so that having engaged here below your heavenly power, I may offer my thanksgiving and homage to the most loving of fathers. O Saint Joseph, I never weary contemplating you, and Jesus asleep in your arms. I dare not approach while he reposes near your heart. Press him in my name, kiss his fine head for me. Ask him to return the kiss when I draw my dying breath. Saint Joseph, patron of departing souls, pray for me. O Saint Joseph, terror of demons, cast thy solemn gaze upon the devil and his minions. Protect us with thy mighty staff. You fled through the night to avoid the devil's wicked designs. Now, with the power of God, smite the demons as they flee from thee. Grant special protection, we pray, for children and the unborn, families and relationships, work and ministries, homes and possessions, persecuted Christians, priests, and the dying. By God's grace, no demon dares approach while you are near. So we beg of you, St. Joseph, always be near to us. Amen. St. Michael, Gabriel, Raphael, seraphim and cherubim, thrones and dominions, virtues, powers, and principalities, archangels and guardian angels, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, O princes of the heavenly host, by the divine power of God, thrust into hell, Satan, and all evil spirits, who prowl about the world, seeking the ruin of souls, amen. Come, Holy Spirit. Angels of God, our guardians dear, to whom God's love commits us here, ever the stay be at our side, to light and guard, to rule and guide, amen. On Tuesdays, we renew our consecration to the holy angels and to St. Michael. O holy angels of God, here in the presence of the triune God, and in the love of Jesus Christ, my Lord and Redeemer, I, and then say your name, Mary Elizabeth Ann Klaska, a poor sinner, want to make a covenant with you who are his servants, so that in union with you I might work with humility and fortitude for the glory of God and the coming of his kingdom. Therefore, I implore you to assist me, especially in the adoration of God and of the most holy sacrament of the altar, in the contemplation of the word and the salvific works of God in the imitation of Christ and in the love of his cross and a spirit of expiation, in the faithful fulfillment of my mission within the church, serving humbly after the example of Mary, my heavenly mother and your queen, and you, my good guardian angel, who continually behold the face of our Father in heaven, God entrusted me to you from the very beginning of my life. I thank you with all my heart for your loving care and I commit myself to you and promise you my love and fidelity. I beg you to protect me against my own weakness and the attacks of the wicked spirits. Enlighten my mind and heart so that I may always know and accomplish the will of God. Lead me to union with God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. O most noble prince of the angelic hierarchies, valorous warrior of almighty God and zealous lover of his glory, terror of the rebellious angels and love and delight of all the just angels. My beloved Archangel St. Michael, desiring to be numbered among your devoted servants, I today offer and consecrate myself to you and place myself, my family, and all I possess under your most powerful protection. I entreat you not to look at how little I as your servant have to offer, being only a wretched sinner, 
but to gaze rather with favorable eye at the heartfelt affection with which this offering is made. And remember that if from this day onward I am under your patronage, you must during all of my life assist me and procure for me the pardon of my many grievous offenses and sins, the grace to love with all of my heart my God and Savior Jesus, my sweet mother Mary, and to obtain for me all the help necessary to arrive at my crown of glory. Defend me always from my temporal and spiritual enemies, particularly in the last moments of my life. Come then, O glorious Prince, and succor me in my last struggle. With your powerful weapon, cast far from me into the infernal abysses, that provocator and proud angel that one day you prostrated in the celestial battle. Amen. And we pray for the souls that have died. Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and may your perpetual light shine upon them. May their souls and all the souls of the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Eternal God, we offer to you the most precious blood of thy divine son, Jesus, in union with the masses said throughout the world for all the holy souls in purgatory, sinners everywhere, those in the universal church, within our own home and within our own family. Amen. St. Patrick's Breastplate Prayer. I arise today through a mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity, through belief in the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation. I arise today through the strength of Christ's birth with his baptism, through the strength of his crucifixion with his burial, through the strength of his resurrection with his ascension, through the strength of his descent for the judgment of doom. I arise today through the strength of the love of the cherubim, in the obedience of angels and the service of the archangels and the hope of resurrection to meet with reward, in the prayers of patriarchs, predictions of prophets, the preaching of apostles, the faith of confessors, in the innocence of holy virgins and the deeds of righteous men, I arise today through the strength of heaven, the light of the sun, the radiance of the moon, the splendor of fire, the speed of lightning, the swiftness of wind, the depth of the sea, the stability of the earth, and the firmness of rock. I arise today through God's strength to pilot me, God's might to uphold me, God's wisdom to guide me, God's eye to look before me, God's ear to hear me, God's word to speak for me, God's hand to guard me, God's shield to protect me, God's host to save me. From the snares of the devil, from temptations of vices, from everyone who wishes me ill afar and near. I summon today all these powers between me and those evils against every cruel and merciless power that may oppose my body and soul, against incantations of false prophets and black laws of paganism, false laws of heretics and the craft of idolatry, against spells of witches and smiths, wizards, satanists, and warlords, and against every knowledge that corrupts man's body and soul. Jesus Christ, to shield me today against poison and burning, choking and suffocating, destruction and accidents, pestilence, infestation and plague, against drowning and wounding, sickness and calumny, jealousy, competition, blocking and division, misunderstanding, confusion, fear and worry, disobedience and disrespect, greed, rash or false judgment, vanity, selfishness and pride, against anger and lust, dishonesty and betrayal, denial, abandonment, rejection, indifference, and unfaithfulness, and against every evil that could come against me, so that there may come to me instead an abundance of reward. Jesus Christ be with me, Jesus Christ before me, Jesus Christ behind me, Jesus Christ in me, Jesus Christ beneath me, Jesus Christ above me, Jesus Christ on my right, Jesus Christ on my left. Jesus Christ when I lie down, Jesus Christ when I sit down. Jesus Christ when I arise. Jesus Christ in the heart of every man who thinks of me. Jesus Christ in the mouth of everyone who speaks of me. Jesus Christ in every eye that sees me. Jesus Christ in every ear that hears me. I arise today through a mighty strength, the invocation of the Trinity, through belief in the threeness, through confession of the oneness of the creator of creation. Amen. And on the special feast day of Our Lady of the Visitation, I want to pray St. Louis de Montfort's beautiful prayer to Our Lady, and then a couple prayers in the litany to the Maria Bambina, to the Infant Mary, in honor of the book that I'm publishing today on her, House of Gold. 
And we ask her intercession as we pray this morning, especially for powerful fruitfulness for this book in the world, that those virtues of her innocence, her littleness, her humility, her purity, her love, may explode grace throughout the world. We pray for many translations, for many donors, so that we can provide this for free to people. And most importantly, that we may be formed in imitation of this little Mary. Hail Mary, beloved daughter of the eternal Father. Hail Mary, admirable mother of the Son. Hail Mary, faithful spouse of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, my dear mother, my loving mistress, my powerful sovereign. Hail my joy, my glory, my heart, and my soul. Thou art all mine by mercy, and I am all thine by justice, but I am not yet sufficiently thine. I now give myself wholly to thee without keeping anything back for myself or others. If thou seest still in me anything that does not belong to thee, I beseech thee to take it and make thyself the absolute mistress of all that is mine. Destroy in me all that may be displeasing to God. Root it up and bring it to naught. Place and cultivate in me everything that is pleasing to thee. May the light of thy faith dispel the darkness of my mind. May thy profound humility take the place of my pride. May thy sublime contemplation Check the distractions of my wandering imagination. May thy continuous sight of God fill my memory with his presence. May the burning love of thy heart inflame the lukewarmness of mine. May thy virtues take the place of my sins. May thy merits be my only adornment in the sight of God and make up for all that is wanting it. Finally, dearly beloved mother, Grant, if it be possible, that I have no other spirit but thine to know Jesus and his divine will, that I have no other soul but thine to praise and glorify the Lord, that I have no other heart but thine to love God with a love as pure and ardent as thine. I do not ask thee for visions, revelations, sensible devotions, or spiritual pleasures. It is thy divine privilege to see God clearly. It is thy privilege to enjoy heavenly bliss. It is thy privilege to triumph gloriously in heaven at the right hand of thy son and to hold absolute sway over angels, men, and demons. It is thy privilege, my mother, to dispose of all the gifts of God, just as thou willest. Such is, O heavenly Mary, the best part which the Lord has given to you and which shall never be taken away from you. And this thought fills my heart with joy. As for my part here below, I wish for no other than that which was thine, to believe sincerely without spiritual pleasures, to suffer joyfully without human consolation, to die continually to myself without respite, and to work zealously and unselfishly for you until death as the humblest of your servants. The only grace I beg of you to obtain for me is that every day and every moment of my life I may say, Amen, so be it, to all that you do while on earth. Amen, so be it, to all that you are now doing in heaven. Amen, so be it, to all that you are doing in my soul, so that you alone may fully glorify Jesus in me for time and for all eternity. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy Mother of God, despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin Mary, amen. Loving mother of the Redeemer, gate of heaven and star of the sea, assist your people who have fallen yet strive to rise again. To the wonderment of nature, you bore your creator yet remained a virgin after as before. You who received Gabriel's joyful greeting, have pity on us poor sinners. Hail bright star of ocean, God's own mother blessed, ever sinless virgin, gate of heavenly rest, taking that sweet ave, which from Gabriel came, peace confirm within us, changing Eva's name. Break the captive's fetters, light on blindness pour, all our ills expelling, every bliss implore. Show thyself a mother, may the word divine, born for us thy infant, hear our prayers through thine. Virgin all excelling, mildest of the mild, 
Freed from guilt, preserve us, pure and undefiled. Keep our life all spotless, make our way secure, till we find in Jesus joy forevermore. Through the highest heaven, to the almighty three, Father, Son, and Spirit, one same glory be. Amen. And we pray a special prayer to Our Lady, the Maria Bambina, the Infant Mary. Holy Child Mary of the Royal House of David, Queen of the Angels, Mother of Grace and Love, I greet you with all of my heart. Obtain for me the grace to love the Lord faithfully during all the days of my life. Obtain for me, too, a great devotion to you, who are the first creature of God's love. O heavenly child Mary, who like a pure dove was born immaculate and beautiful, true progeny of the wisdom of God, my soul rejoices in you. O do help me to preserve the angelic virtue of purity at the cost of any sacrifice. Hail, lovely and holy child, spiritual garden of delight, where on the day of the incarnation, the tree of life was planted. Assist me to avoid poisonous fruit of vanity and all the pleasures of the world. Hail, admirable child Mary, mystical rose, closed garden, open only to the heavenly spouse, O lily of paradise. Make me love the humble and hidden life. Let the heavenly spouse find the gate of my heart always open to the loving calls of his grace and inspiration. Holy child Mary, mystical dawn, gate of heaven, you are my trust and hope. O powerful advocate from your cradle, stretch out your hand and support me on the path of life. Make me serve God with ardor and constancy until death, and so reach an eternity with you. Blessed child Mary, Maria Bambina, destined to be the mother of God and our loving mother. By the heavenly graces you lavish on us, mercifully listen to all of my supplications. In the needs which press upon me from every side, and especially in my present tribulations, I place all my trust in you. O holy child Mary, by the privileges granted to you alone, and by the merits which you have acquired, show that the source of spiritual favors and the continuous benefits which you dispense are inexhaustible because your power with the heart of God is unlimited. Deign through the immense profusion of grace with which the Most High has enriched you from the first moment of your immaculate conception, grant me, O celestial child Mary, my petitions, which I shall earnestly, eternally praise the goodness of your immaculate heart. Amen. Lord of mercy on us, Christ of mercy on us, Lord of mercy on us. Infant Jesus, hear us. Infant Jesus, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Infant Mary, pray for us. Infant Daughter of the Father, pray for us. Infant Mother of the Son, pray for us. Infant Spouse of the Holy Spirit, pray for us. Infant fruit of the prayer of thy parents, pray for us. Infant sanctuary of the Holy Trinity, pray for us. Infant riches of thy father, pray for us. Infant delight of thy mother, pray for us. Infant honor of thy father, mother, pray for us. Infant honor of thy mother, pray for us. Infant miracle of nature, pray for us. Infant progeny of grace, pray for us. Immaculate in thy conception, pray for us. Most holy in thy nativity, pray for us. Most devout in thy presentation, pray for us. Masterpiece of God's grace, pray for us. Aura of the Son of Justice, pray for us. Beginning of our joy, pray for us. End of our evil, pray for us. Infant joy of earth, pray for us. Pattern of our charity, pray for us. Model of humility, pray for us. Infant most powerful, pray for us. Infant most mild, pray for us. Infant most pure, pray for us. Infant most obedient, pray for us. Infant most poor, pray for us. Infant most meek, pray for us. Infant most amiable, pray for us. Infant most admirable, pray for us. 
Infant incomparable, pray for us. Infant health of the sick, pray for us. Comfortess of the afflicted, pray for us. Refuge of sinners, pray for us. Hope of Christians, pray for us. Lady of the angels, pray for us. Daughter of the patriarchs, pray for us. Desire of the prophets, pray for us. Mistress of the apostles, pray for us. Strength of martyrs, pray for us. Glory of the priesthood, pray for us. Joy of confessors, pray for us. Purity of virgins, pray for us. Queen of all saints, pray for us. Infant our mother, pray for us. Infant queen of our heart, pray for us. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us, O Lord. Infant Jesus, hear us. Infant Jesus, graciously hear us. Let us pray. O almighty and merciful God, who through the cooperation of the Holy Spirit prepared the body and soul of the Immaculate Infant Mary, that she might be the worthy mother of your Son, and preserved her from all stain, grant that we who venerate with all of our hearts her most holy childhood may be freed through her merits and intercession from all uncleanness of mind and body, and be able to imitate her perfect humility, obedience, and charity. Through Christ our Lord, amen. Jesus, meek and humble of heart, make our hearts like unto thine. O sacred heart of Jesus, have mercy on us, Immaculate and sorrowful heart of Our Lady, pray for us. Good Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Xenia, pray for us. Elizabeth of Hungary and Elizabeth of Portugal, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, pray for us. Timothy and Titus, Matthias and Jude and Rita, pray for us. Saint Francis and Claire, pray for us. Rose of Lima and Martin de Porres, pray for us. Therese of Lisieux, Teresa of Avila, John on the Cross, pray for us. Padre Pio, pray for us. Saint John Eudes, pray for us. All of you holy angels, pray for us. All of you holy martyrs, pray for us. All of you holy saints, pray for us. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Thank you for praying with me. I'm glad I didn't fall asleep on you. I hardly slept last night trying to get these books done. Um, but I'm glad that we could do this and look on my page and on Amazon later today for that book, House of Gold. It's a consecration to the infant heart of Our Lady. And I will be back tomorrow. God bless you.